When it comes to inherited IRAs, you may have a lot of questions. Well, fortunately, today we are joined by our finance expert, Julie Newton, with what you need to know. Good morning, Julie. How's it going? It's great. Good morning. So, Julie, when it comes to inherited IRAs, do you need to take that money out right away? What do you need to do? So, it kind of depends on who passed away. So, mm -hmm. the difference being if a spouse passes away, you do not have to take that money out. You can leave it in the IRA or you can move it into an IRA for yourself, okay? Now, if you're a non-spousal beneficiary, so whether the person you inherited from is a grandparent, a parent, a friend, a neighbor, whatever that looks like, then you have certain rules that you have to adhere to. So um, the one thing to keep in mind is that you have 10 years to get that money out if you're a non-spousal uh, beneficiary. So there's tax consequences involved. So it's really important that you work with a tax professional and a financial advisor to make sure you're meeting those rules uh, when it comes to inherited IRAs. Okay, and so if you inherit an investment account, do you have to pay taxes on it? So um, again, a couple of different ways of looking that, at that. So typically when you inherit, there is a federal uh, limit on the size of an estate before you are taxed on that. Um, the average person isn't going to end up paying taxes because in 2024 that level is a little over 13 million. Mm -hmm. However, um, what you have to keep in mind is if it's a regular investment account, which means not pre-tax, not an IRA, um, there are going to potentially be tax consequences if you have a capital gain. So when you sell something in that account, then you might have to pay capital gains tax. So again, work with that tax professional on those inheritances. Okay, a lot of things to keep in mind. So yeah. what is one thing everyone should know when it comes to inherited IRAs? Um, don't take it all out at once before consulting a tax professional mm -hmm. and your financial advisor. Make sure you're working with a, a complete team because if you take it all out, you don't know ahead of time what that tax consequence might be and you can cause yourself a lot of tax pain. Okay, so if people want to learn more, how can they do that, Julie? They can go to our website, marketadvisorygroup.com, uh, schedule an appointment with one of our advisors or they can call the office and schedule there. Okay, thanks so much for being here today. Thank you. Ask Our Advisor on Kansas City Spotlight has been paid for by Market Advisory Group. For more information, visit marketadvisorygroup.com.